Um, all right, so we're talking about switch kick, switch knee, all these types of things. You know, at the most basic level, the reason why we're throwing, we're going to switch before we strike is because if I try to kick with my left leg, I don't have much momentum. I'm trying to build momentum up with my hip from this range. So we make the switch happen, so now my left leg has become my rear leg. So now I have all the twist and hip torque and all those types of things. That's the, at the most basic level. Same thing with the switch knee. Boom, I'm just bringing my left leg back, like Jason explained earlier, so I can drive in with more momentum. What I want you guys to work on, though, is now making the switch work for you. You should, well, I guess in, in theoretical terms, the left kick and the left knee should be more powerful than the right counterpart. The reason being is because when I make the switch, what I want you guys to watch my feet, not my hands. When I make the switch, I want to stomp off the ground with that back step. So I, I switch, this is a stomping action. All right, now, think about it. If I threw a tennis ball at the wall at 50 miles an hour, it bounces off the wall, it's not going to come back at 50 miles an hour, it's going to be less. Right? So you could argue that actually making the bounce kills the power of my kick. However, the difference between the ball scenario and the switch kick is that now we have an external force working on the kick after the bounce, being my muscles. I'm not just throwing the ball and then it bounce, I hit the ground, then I bounce off the ground, and now I use my entire body to drive in. So we're giving a head start to our foot now. So instead of switching, my foot starts at zero miles per hour and it requires my entire body to drive. When I make the bounce, boom, my foot's already going at 30 miles an hour or so, and then I drive it out. So when we switch with the kick, I'm going to bounce and hit, or when I switch with the knee, I bounce off the ground and drive in. So that bouncing action is where we're going to get our power.